Hey everyone, so characteristics of money, there are six characteristics of money and one of the core characteristics of money is that money should be durable. Durability is what we are talking about here. Money must be able to withstand being used repetitively. Everyone is using money on a daily basis. Imagine if your money ripped or broke when you were using it. I mean, that would be severely impractical. It has to be durable um, as a core characteristic and it is a core characteristic of money. Secondly, money should also be portable. It should easily be able to be transferred to other individuals and can be easily carried around. Imagine if money was really hard, difficult to uh, carry, carry around. Imagine if it was really heavy, for instance. I mean, that would be just impractical altogether. So portability is a very important important characteristic of money. Thirdly, money should also be divisible, ideally and preferably, into smaller units of value. So, for example, um, in the UK, for instance, you have the Great British Pound divided into £10, £5 notes, and then, of course, £2 coins, £1 coins, 50 pence, etc. Makes the transaction much more simple and easier to complete. Fourthly, Money should also be a widely accepted method of transaction. It can also be used for different types of transaction, of course, like, for instance, debit card payments, uh, credit card payments, cash check amounts, um, all in the same form of money makes it acceptable and also has a degree of uh, acceptability uh, when it comes to uh, exchanging money. Fifthly, interestingly, is that money should be scarce. It should be limited in supply in order for the value to remain stable. Imagine if everyone's, everyone's got loads of money. That value of money is not going to be as high to someone who's got it, but it's scarce in amount. It's very limited in, in amount. So scarcity is also an important characteristic of money. And lastly, security. Money must be extremely difficult to counterfeit. Otherwise, if you get duplicated, kind of, um, you know, duplicated money, it becomes very hard to have a medium of exchange. Now, look at this, guys. Believe it or not, these different forms, these used to be the different forms of money. Eggs, can you imagine that? Cows, shells, even pigs used to be used back in the good old days in the past as a form of money. Now, if I give you a moment to think, why are these different forms not accepted as a characteristic of money? Well, you can probably think of why, you know, imagine eggs. They're probably not going to be easy to trans, you know, transfer. Portability is going to be extremely difficult. And therefore, what's really important is actually the money now has these six characteristics so that it helps us make transactions easier and much more simpler as well. So being durable, portable, divisible, acceptable, scarce and also secure you know as a consumer that you will be able to make that transaction without any hesitation and problem. So those are the six characteristics of money.